Uh, this is the second video of Mr. Charles Liang, whom you can see on the left, the CEO of Super Microcomputers. And in this video, he is in interview with uh, another CEO, uh, Mrs. Susan Liu of AMD. AMD is also a processing uh, computer processing unit uh, company, very large scale, alongside Intel and others. So in this interview, the main topic here is about uh, data centers. And the aspect uh, which is being introduced here is about the fact that the, com the company of Mr. Charles Liang has leveraged a lot into data center business. Uh, they've made a lot of inroads uh, into the market, and uh, I think that is also driving currently their high profits. And there are reports that the company also made a tremendous uh, gain in share value by over 100%, unbelievably so. And that also tells you that uh, this market is very um, much uh, profitable. Um, alongside with NVIDIA, there are also uh, super computer manufacturing hardware company, also made profits of over 100%. So they are all leveraging this time on data centers. Data centers are very useful as we are learning, and uh, there are many clients. The demand is uh, quite high, as we are told. So the two companies are making a, a lot of inroads into that market. And uh, the profitability and the returns are already visible and very palpable, as we might say. So in this interview, they were being, uh, they were being taken through a session by that gentleman who is a media house um, owner, private media house owner. And uh, we came al across a lot of information but the one I'll send you is really about the challenges of data centers as they are in terms of their heat energy requirements uh, and also the aspect that uh, they must be cooled quite tremendously uh, because of the amount of heat they, they produce. So you learn maybe more from this um, interview. It's a very short one, but I'm sure it's going to be very helpful in, f in improving or increasing your knowledge uh, of data centers in general, or even the case of accelerated computing, which the data centers actually are now using through these two companies, NVIDIA and Supermicrocomputer. And of course, uh, uh, what we call supercomputers and uh, all those technicalities. You might want to know that these two companies are actually the leaders in manufacture of supercomputer hardware, including the graphical processing units.